four. Wexford Youths, in case you joined us late, Tamara Furlong, the 19-year-old, came in after about a half an hour for the injured Mary Rose Kelly. Siobhan Killeen. Killeen! What a goal! Has she been watching William for Chelsea? She has, but the goalkeeper has also been watching. Well saved. Oh, oh it's the crossbar again! It's in, it's in, it's in! They level! For the third year in a row, I think the Women's Cup final is going to go inside there. The day attempting to drive. Near post again, well headed clear by Kira Kiba. And it's in the back of the net! They have done it, Wexford Youths have gone in front. Maria Delahunty, I think, put it in first time from the edge of the box. A break. Down to Kiva Keenan. Chipped in here. Here's a chance! Great opportunity and Cray and it's a lot of noise and din. She steps up calmly and Wexford Hughes are one in front. Noel Murray next. Oh, she's had it saved. Tamara first has come back from injuries to play her part and to score. Wexford Hughes two up. It's two one. Yes, they need team three one up. No mistake. Very, very confident penalty. Calmly done. Go, what can Neil Walsh do? Same thing, back of the net. Yeah, it was a very good penalty by Neil. I was going to be forgotten if this goes in. And it has. No misses. So and now the pressure really on Shauna Newman. Can it afford to miss this one? Oh, she's hit the bar. And Wexford Utes have won the cup final. Two misses by Shelburne players. Wexford get four of their five taken penalties. And now it's just a matter of the captain coming up to take possession of the trophy. There she is. Handed over by Nia O'Donoghue, the chairperson. And lifted her off by Kylie Murphy, captain of Wexford News, ladies. And they are the cup winners. Hard luck to Shelburne. It was a very, very good cup final. And we have the FAI Continental Player of the Match here, Noel Murray. Noel